let's talk a little bit about progress, shall we? Uh, it's kind of the big theme of my life at the moment. I, I don't know if you guys are following me on Instagram or not. Um, this isn't even a plug. I'm just talking about what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm trying to post a picture there every single day. Um, I'm also trying to remain consistent with my video upload schedule um, because I've kind of been neglecting creativity this summer. Um, and almost ironically, because I have all these like massive swirling thoughts of like career aspirations and projects in my head at all times. And what that's done, it's like overwhelmed me to the point where I've just stopped making things. Um, because I'm not making the big things, I'm not doing the things that I want to be doing, and so because I'm not doing that, nothing else feels worthwhile. And that's not true <laughs> at all. I, um, I'm kind of going back to, to move forward in a way because I'm trying to reinstall um, a big theme of sort of my life prior to moving to Los Angeles, and that is um, simplifying. And that's just sort of focusing on what's in front of me and believing in the small things and the little things and how they build up and become bigger things. Because that's all that big things are. You know, we look at other people, we look at other, like, art pieces or movies or whatever, and we see the finished product. We see, like, you know, what, what has been worked on for um, oftentimes years and years and years. We see all that context, but we just see it in one moment. And, um, and it's really easy to look at things like that and be like, oh, I want that. But what you actually want isn't that. What you actually want is all of it. And, uh, and with all of it comes the little things. You know, I, I've talked about how um, everything should be significant. And everything is significant, but sometimes things can be too significant because they feel too big. You know, and when things are big, I get overwhelmed and I just hide from them because big things are scary. So instead, what I'm trying to do is, um, is just progress. You know, it's just work on the little things, you know, the stuff that's in front of me. What do I have control over in my life right now? And one of the things that has been a huge tenant of my personal growth has been making videos and has been uh, sharing things with you guys and has been just with making things, small things, you know. I don't have to be out there making uh, like feature length films even though that's what I want to be doing, like, right now, I don't have to do that right now. What I have to do is build myself up to that point where I'm strong enough, where I'm ready to do that, and where I have, like, the experience and mental strength to take on something like that, you know? Um, I often get asked for advice uh, about moving, like, across the country or whatever, and, uh, and I, just, I always remember sort of my feelings a little over a year ago when I did that, um, and that it did not feel like a big deal when I moved. It did not feel like this earth-shattering, uh, like, life-altering thing that was happening to my life. What it felt like was the next logical step. Um, and I want to I wanna get back to the process that led me there, because what led me there was years of just consistent and constant little growth here and there, you know? No big spikes, no uh, huge blow-ups, no whatever, no massive life achievements, just little things. You know, and I have people say things like, I'm so proud of you for all for that. That was like such a big deal. And I'm like, it doesn't feel like a big deal. And that's good because it shouldn't feel like a big deal. Your successes shouldn't feel like that. You should earn them, you know, and part of earning them, unfortunately, you know, is that sometimes we don't enjoy them as much as we should. We don't experience them as fully as we should because to us, the big things don't feel big. They feel just like all the little small. They just feel like more of the same. Um, so it's hard to strike that balance between experiencing stuff as significant as it should be, but also um, keeping on the path. And I've kind of not veered off the path completely, but, um, but I've forgotten the path. And I've stopped trusting the path. Um, and so that's what I'm trying to do. And so, you know, my videos are not the level that I maybe want them to be, like, narratively or whatever, but you guys are going to get me. And, uh, and I'm excited to share that in whatever that means uh, because I'm building little. I'm building little by little. And that's what I'm doing. And I hope you guys can get there too. Um, because, you know, this, is, this isn't just about me. I don't want it to be just about me because that's boring <laughs> and selfish. I don't like that. Uh, but yeah, that's all I had to talk about. If you guys have any thoughts or stories you want to share in the comments, I would love to hear them and read them and experience them and all that jazz. But uh, I'm going to get off of here and I'll see you guys on Monday. Hello, hello, friends. Um, it's incredible to think that August is almost over, which is insane. Uh, I'm very happy to be back on schedule. I make videos every Monday and Friday here on YouTube. Uh, like I said, I mentioned on Instagram, I'm doing all that. I have all my other social networks in the description if you want to keep in touch with me. Um, I, I'm really active on Twitter. Uh, if you want to talk to me on there, Tumblr as well. 
Love you guys a lot. I'm gonna go. Bye!